Hey guys, I'm Loy and I'm with DesignWall. We're going to be guiding you through the process of optimizing your WordPress website. Disable unused WordPress thumbnails. Prevent creating unused thumbnail sizes which slow down load time. The first thing you guys got to do is go to settings and then media. Next, under the media size tab, set max width and max height to zero. Do the same thing on the large size, zero and zero. Save your changes and now the settings are saved. Now whenever you add a new media file, it'll only upload the small thumbnails. Optimize the image before loading. Smaller file sizes result in quicker performance. In order to do this part, there's any number of websites that you can choose. For, for our case, we're gonna use TinyPNG. You go to TinyPNG, you upload your image, and they'll compress it for you. You download the new image, save it under whatever name you want, in this case, we'll say, we'll save it as image-optimize. After you've downloaded your file, you can select it and upload it to WordPress. It's crunching, and now it's done. Regenerating thumbnails WordPress, optimizing performance. For this part, you gotta search WordPress for plugins. Regenerate thumbnail. As you can see, there are many, some of them with tons of people using them. We're gonna use Regenerate Thumbnails on the right. It's gonna install the plugin for us. We activate the plugin. Plugin activated. Tools, Regenerate Thumbnails. Regenerate all thumbnails. And since we only have one, this happened really quickly. Removing emoji from WordPress. Getting professional. Removing emojis has to do with using the inspect tool. As a background process, WordPress automatically uploads emojis to your website. Afterwards, you go to our, our GitHub, copy our code, and then paste it in. You can see now that after we refresh the page in the HTML, it no longer loads. It doesn't exist there anymore. Cleaning up the WordPress menu. Simply organized. In order to clean up the WordPress menu, once again, we've got to look at the code. Here's the HTML. You can see all the code right here. This is where all the menus are. All we have to do is add some functions to our functions.php file, and then that'll get rid of it. Once again, we go to our Gist Hub page, open up Atom, and then functions.php, copy and paste in, reload, and now you can see that all the code is gone. These menus are no longer there, and they will no longer load so your website is faster. Using WordPress cache plugins, faster loads. Don't forget to disable your cache plugins. We highly recommend that because during development, your website will load faster. We suggest W3 Total Cached, and we also suggest WP Super Cache. Using CDN service, content delivery networks. Another great way to optimize your website is using CDN services. They have servers located throughout the world and they cache the files for you. That way, no matter where your user is, your website will load much faster. Using anti-spam plugins, protecting your website. You should also use anti-spam software. That will definitely improve your network. Conclusions, testing and backup, strongly advised. In this video, we've introduced ways to optimize your website. But remember two very important things. Test before and after trying out the different tools. The tools that we recommend are Pidgedom, Google Page Tool, and GT Metrics. Back up your website before optimization. Here's the result of our optimization after we did the work. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you and goodbye. Like a hurricane To my heart Go the fire